You know what? I have no idea why I'm actually even doing this video. Or I just kind of, uh, I'm not saying I feel compelled. I just sometimes feel like the need to just, um, I don't know, center myself or take stock or uh, just take, I don't know, uh, whatever. Um, yeah, I was doing um, some of, uh, like like I said with the live stream, it's, come, it's clicking slowly. Uh, but I'm happy the way it's going in the sense that I'm starting to figure out... Um, uh, you know, a manageable way, uh, for the week. So it, it doesn't feel overwhelming, but I still feel like, um, yeah, I'm doing something proper. I'm not like slacking off or just doing a half-ass job or whatever. It's, you know, it's working out. Um, but anyways, let's get to the, the gist of this video. I'm sure this is not, um, a, su a surprise to probably anyone. Um, I am mind-bogglingly, uh, immature, um, and it's just, I guess sometimes it's just nice to, for me to take stock of that, um, once in a while. I mean, there's big chunks of me, man, that, um, probably stopped growing up at, uh, let's say age 12. I can remember, for example, and I mean, it's gotten me into a lot of problems, man, over the years, a lot of problems, um, yeah, you know, it's amazing that I've somehow been able to, I don't know, bumble and stumble my way through life and uh, not, uh, you know, whatever. But um, I mean, I'll, I'll give a perfect example. I can remember, uh, and look, I'm not making light of what I'm about to say. Like, you don't know my backstory and so on and so forth. So uh, trust me, I'm not like, I'm just trying to make an impact of how it how it felt to me. I can remember, my God, I think I was 16 and uh, we were out for dinner or something for my dad picking up some motorcycle bit or something. And, um, my parents asked me at, you know, dinner at the, at the restaurant, uh, like, so what do you want to do when you graduate? Oh, I can't, I still remember that eve that evening and how I felt it was, I'm not kidding you. It felt just as if the doctor would have told me I had cancer. I, I was so, beyond speechless, beyond shocked, beyond, I couldn't believe that my reality was about to just be destroyed in a, you know, in a year or two or whatever it was. Um, uh, that meant I would have to leave my bedroom. That meant I had to leave my books. That means I had to grow up. Uh, that means I had to do like a gazillion other things. And I just was not even remotely ready for any of that stuff. Not even close. Um, yeah, and then flash back to now and I'm like, you know, every once in a while. So what I'm saying is also yet again, like when I start doing this YouTube stuff, sometimes I'm like, I've got to remind myself. It's like, Chris, you're also a massively immature person. Um, and you're still a child in many, many ways. So, uh, and you are interacting in adult land in a, in a very big adult land. Like, okay. Uh, there's a 10 year old, I think oh, she's about 10 years old. I can't really tell, uh, ages or whatever, but, uh, she subscribed to my channel. I think just based on the fact that we share last name, she's, um, out in England or something. And, um, I thought, oh my God, it's like some long lost family member or something trying to, you know, some weird second cousin or something. Anyways, and I was like, no, it's just some rando, uh, whatever. Um, and I was like, oh, I started, you know, following her or whatever. And it, like, she's awkward and the whole nine yards. And I was like, R -r -r. and I was like, oh my God, I relate to her so much in some ways. I was like, even enjoying the children's shows and, and on and on. I was just like, oh my God. Like, holy cow, you are in trouble, boy. Anyways, um, yeah, so I just was like, you know, that's amazing how you can relate that much to, uh, you know, that uh, kid or whatever. Um, yeah, she's like, forget it. She's like some serial poster from hell. I'm like, uh, I turned off uh, every freaking notification I can. Like, I don't want to ever know. And she's like, uh, like, she's going to be a terror. Like, she must be just blowing out servers. Like there's no tomorrow. Like I, I was like, holy Jesus, jumping. Um, yeah, don't uh, if you ever find her, don't uh, put any notifications on. Otherwise, you're in trouble. Anyways, that's it. Uh, I don't know why I'm saying this. It's um, well, I know why I'm saying. It. I just wanted to like just have a breath of fresh air sometimes, and just have to remind myself it's hard. Um, you know, to uh, I don't know how to say it. It's uh, 
it's a big world. And uh, sometimes I'm like, God, am I ready for this or whatever? And uh, but then sometimes I'm like, or many times lately, anyways, I'm like, you know, I just go people such as like Charles Latour. I'm like those type of people. I'm like, okay, stick with those. Uh, like nice anchors is what I'm trying to say to keep me keep my um, um, my head on the ground kind of thing, you know. So uh, that's it. Okay, hope you're having a good time.